Hello everybody and welcome back to another exciting episode with me, The Real Mr. Gold. I hope that you have been having a great week. Well, it has been a little bit since I have done a video, but I just got done watching Henri's latest video and Plank Tech has struck again. Yeah, she has taken the Cactus Farmily from Henri and Henri had to go save them. What I want to go look at today is whenever he was answering some questions on his video, one of them really stuck out to me. So let's head over to Henri's base and then go to where Plank Tech had taken the Farmerly to and I will be back then. So we are at Henri's base and it looks absolutely amazing. As you can see, he's been doing a lot of work. But going looking at his video, he had to go south to find Plank Tech's jail cell basically. So let's go south and look. Here it is. And I want to go down and show you exactly what this question was and the answer that he gave. So he had to answer these questions to unlock some things. And as you can see, there's the questions up here. And his answers are the ones that's pointed down to turn this light on to open a door. But as you can see here, this one in particular, who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Choices were Mr. Gold or Plank Tech. Why is Plank Tech the one who lives in a pineapple under the sea? That has me worried. I know where there's a pineapple under the sea. And it is at my base. We cannot have Plank Tech living at our base in the pineapple. So I think that we should go over and take a look right now. And make sure that we have not been moved in on. And we are at our base portal. Let's go in. And it is night. But what is this? I saw you wanted to talk to Plank Tech. We should meet first to discuss what to do with her antics. Absolutely. I will definitely come talk to you, Pl er, Tech, before we go talk to Plank Tech. Because I might need some backup. Let's go look at this pineapple, shall we? There's the pineapple under the sea. And it looks safe enough, doesn't it? Yeah, nothing. What is that? Plank tech? Seriously? Why have you moved into one of my houses, Plank tech? I cannot believe this. This has got to stop. I've got to go find Plank Tech if it's the last thing I do. So let's go talk to T uh, Dakota and see what she has to say and see if she can help us with Plank Tech or maybe find Plank Tech. And maybe we can get this whole thing straightened up. And <laughs> not have to worry about Plank Tech anymore.
Oh wow. This looks absolutely incredible. Trick or treat, press the button. Should we do it? Should we press the button and see if we get a trick or a treat? I don't know. What if we die? I don't want to die. Let's do it. Anyways, just to see, shall we? Hmm. What is this? Ah, I got a treat. Yes. Happy Halloween. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Candles. Card pumpkins. Suspicious too. I got rock candy. Oh, I love rock candy. And deep slight diamond ore. Oh my goodness. That is so incredible. I will put all of this to good use. Yes, we did not get tricked. See if we can find Dakota around here anywhere. Man, this is just incredible what she has done here. Dakota, are you here? Dakota. Tack, are you here? Dakota, are you here? No, I guess she's not here. Well, let's go find her and see what she wants to talk about. Well, let's go check one last place to see if maybe she might be hiding somewhere or doing some work in her creeper farm. I do know that she just got that done. So let's take this up. And here is her cats. Ah, there she is, way up there. I see her. Let me go say hi. Dakota. Hello. Hey, Hel it's Hello? Mr. Gold. Hi, Mr. Gold. Too, too far. There we go. How are you doing um, today? Well, I mean, we can go up further if you want to. <laughs> there's, there's more air. Okay, well, let's go up. There we go. That's better. Yeah. Yeah. The view is better, too. We can. Ah, well, nice. we're probably too close for them to spawn now, but <laughs> we would be able to watch them meet their doom. <laughs> it's very satisfying. Uh, yeah, I would think so. Cause... Anyway, what can I do for you? Yeah, well, I seen your signs at my portal saying that you wanted me to talk to you before I talk to Plank Tech. So here I yes. am. Yes. Um, it, it, there was a thing, right? Um, Plank Tech had just taken the farmily and I was really worried that you were walking into a trap. Mm -hmm. But I mean, at, at this point, Henri has freed the farmily. And I, I kind of think that means the danger level is even higher now. Like, I know that sounds a bit paranoid and stuff, but she's going to be looking for retaliation, you know? Yeah, but I'm just, I'm really tired of, like, all of this going on. I mean, she's messing with my family. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I mean, something needs to be done, that's for sure. But I don't know what to do, Mr. Gold. It, it's complicated. It is very, very, very complicated. And I just found out that she moved in to the pineapple. Can you believe that? She did what? She moved into my pineapple. Under the sea. The the SpongeBob house? Yes. No way. Yes, she did. I cannot that, believe it. No, no. That's that's uncalled for. Like you can't just take over someone else's house. It's I agree. Kind of rude actually. It's, it's very rude. I really do need to confront her and see what in the world is going on. What does she want? Maybe I can do something for her. Anything. I mean, 
I would almost beg and plead at this point. Well, I mean, you, you're going to, here, 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 follow me. You're going to need to be able to defend yourself at the very least. Like, it, it's not, you can't go facing off against plank tack and not be able to defend yourself. Mm -hmm. So, like, this is, this is, it's okay, though. I, I can get you, um, how many swords do you want? <laughs> I have one right now. That's not enough swords. You need more swords. Okay. Hang on. I'll get you more swords, Mr. Gold. It's okay. It won't take me very long. They're just right here. These guys sell swords by the truckload. How do you feel about attacking Plank Tack with a shovel? A shovel? I yeah. mean... I've heard it works pretty good if you hit him on the head. Okay. Shovels, too. Mm -hmm. Here's some shovels. And that should be enough swords, I think. So I've I got hope. four swords and six shovels. I would hope that that would be enough. Do you, do you feel equipped? Should should I get? I can get more. How 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 about axes? Do you need axes? Ooh, you know I could use probably one or two. Only one or two. Well, I figure the shovels are probably good, but <laughs> I'll take whatever. She might start throwing wood at me or something. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> or she might imprison you in some sort of log structure. Yeah. Yeah, um, how how are you on picks? Uh, I have two. Oh, do you, do you need more than that? Mm, let's do three or four. Okay, and here are some picks. Do you have enough inventory room for all this? Mm, not that one. Hmm, it's going to be a problem. There's one. Okay, perfect. I, I found one. Is, is that enough equipment? Do you, uh, yes, do you need I, anything else? I think that will be perfect. I, are you sure? Yes. Okay. I okay. think it's more than enough. If, if you're if you're positive. I, I don't want you going into this unarmed because I think it's going to be very dangerous. Well, let's hope that she can be reasonable, and it won't have to come to that. But, you know, if... I, I hope so. I For your sake, I hope so. Just in case, I might want to get my chest plate out. Oh, yes. Yes. Good call. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I can't believe you're doing this. You're so brave. And and you're doing it in defense of all of paper hats. Well, we we should give you a title. We should christen you Grand Inquisitor Mr. Gold. That does have a good ring to it. But to be it honest, does. can I tell you something? What? I'm kind of shaking in my boots. <gasps> oh no. Um How how are you on food? Do you need sustenance? Uh I have sixty one carrots. Oh, well, are they golden carrots at least? Yes, they are golden okay. carrots. Well, that that's good. Um, I, I can get you more. Boy, the more stuff that you get for me, the more I feel like that I was very unequipped. What could I have done without I'm, you? I'm sorry, I wasn't trying to make you feel inadequate <laughs> or anything. No, I mean, this, that... is a, this is a big help, right? Yeah, exactly, exactly. That should be enough carrots to get you through, um, whatever. And if you need more afterwards, um, I've I've got this crew of farmers that they, to be honest, they kind of don't do anything. They just hang out there all day. So they're always available for trading. Awesome. How do they get their food if they don't do anything? I. 
I don't know. That's kind of sus now that you mention it. I know. Oh my gosh, I've been eating this all season. <laughs> Maybe we should tackle that one another day. Let's get rid of plank okay. tech first. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's that's a that's a good plan. That's a that's a very good plan. We'll stop thinking about those guys. Yeah. Okay, so you have everything you need for I this. I have for... everything. Okay. I'm ready. <sighs> I, I hope this goes well for you, Mr. Gold. Really, I do. Thank you for all your help. You're welcome. Here we go. Bye. I, I feel like I should cheer you on like those parades in in like World War II where they would cheer people on as they headed off to, <laughs> to Europe. Where do you think I should like start looking for her at? I really don't know. Um, I, I mean, I don't know. She hangs, she hangs out like everywhere. I know. Maybe, maybe you could check by the um chum wagon, uh, ice cream thing. Yeah, yeah, I did. Uh accidentally buy something from there so maybe she's going and getting some diamonds <laughs> you accident you accidentally bought something well okay. i, I kind of got tricked <laughs> but you know how she can how be did, how, oh yeah that's that's how how did how, oh okay well you, you don't have to tell me how you got tricked but I'll, thank you she, she has to pick up the profits at some time right yes so uh, okay i'll go there and check it out thank you very much Yep, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Good luck. Bye. Bye. And here we are at the shopping district. So let's run over to her shop and see if she is there. Plank Tech, are you here? What are you doing, Mr. Gold? Where are you at? You are trespassing. I need to talk to you very badly. I can hear you. You can speak. I've come to talk to you about why you have been acting the way that you have around the, uh, around the server. Why you stole Henri's formerly... Why you keep putting signs out and why you are living in my pineapple. Do I need a reason? I am Plank Tech. Always looking. Always watching. I would really like to try to talk about it and see if we can get things figured out. Yeah, there you are. I see Mischief you. is my middle name. I spy everyone from on high. I do not have a god complex. Do we need to fight it out, or can we talk like civilized people? You want to fight? If that's what it takes, I'm here to put an end to this once and for all. We've got to either live... Together, or there's not enough for the both of us. I don't know if you think you could take me. I will. Don't make me do it. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> See? This is not going to go well, Mr. Gold. What Leave. are you willing to trade in return? I will do whatever needs to be done. Whatever whatever well, you would like. What I have noticed that you were working on Bikini Bottom a lot. Yes. And you built Patrick a house, and you built Squidward a house, and you built SpongeBob a house. But you know what you didn't build? What? You didn't build Plankton a house. 
Is that what this is all about? You just want a house? I'm, I'm homeless. You want to know why I live in your pineapple? It's because you didn't build me a house. So all of this was because I was selfish and I did not think of you? Sure, we'll go with that. Well, I am very, very sorry. And I would love to build you a house. Okay. So long as this house is acceptable, I will leave everyone in peace. Awesome. I will get started on it right away, I promise. And where can I find you whenever I get it done? I will find you. Even better. I will... See you whenever it's done. Well, that was a very fun build, and I hope that Plank Tech is okay with this because I really am wanting all of the mischief and shenanigans to stop for the sake of everybody here on Paper Hats. So she did say that whenever I got done that she would find me, so I guess until then we will go do something else. Bo. Whoa. Where in the world did you come from? I was in the tall grasses watching you build. And does it meet your your needs? Does it do you like it? Do we have a, a deal? It's a lovely building, but I need to see the interior first. Okay. Well, let's swim on over. Welcome home. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yeah? This will do very nicely. Good. I am very glad. So we have an agreement then? 
Oh, sure, sure. I'll be happy to. What, what did you say it, you wanted me to do again? You wanted me to leave everyone alone? Yes, just leave everybody alone. Let everybody be. Don't mess with anybody's stuff. Oh, yes, yes, of course, of course I can do that. Yes, yes, naturally, yes. That is so awesome. I know everybody on the server is going to be happy to hear this. And uh, I am, again, I am really sorry about leaving you out, and I shouldn't have done that. Oh, it happens to the best of us sometimes, you know? Sometimes you're just going through life, and your best friend steals a recipe, and then you spend years trying to get that recipe back. I assume you're talking about a certain crab? You know me so well. Ugh. I hate when people do that. Do what? Steal your recipe. Oh, yes. It's terrible when they steal your recipe, isn't it? It is. It's the worst. But I'm glad that we have... Our agreement is good, and I hope you really enjoy this new house. And it, if you ever need anything, you know, I'm just, like, right next door. Feel free to ask. This will be an excellent place to plot my revenge. Yes, yes, definitely. Revenge, not on us, right? But the crab? Well, the crab isn't here. Unless your skin is a crab skin. In which case, you are the crab. Mm, I am not a crab. So. Then the crab isn't here. So... Someone has to pay. Someone has to pay. But you said you would leave everybody alone. Did I? We had an agreement. I don't remember this. Oh, good grief. Thank you for the house. It's lovely. I guess you're welcome. Yes. Thank you. You're welcome. Goodbye. You sure we can't keep the agreement? What agreement? Oh, man. I guess I should warn the others. What have I done? What have I done? I've got to warn everybody. Got to warn everybody. This is not good at all. I think I've just made this a whole lot worse for everybody, including myself. I was trying to do the right thing, build her a house. And I thought, I actually thought that it was going to work. She was going to take it. And... I could save the day, and she wouldn't bother anybody anymore. But, unfortunately, that did not happen, it don't sound like. <sighs> what to do now? Well, everybody, I think that is going to be it for this episode. I hope that you enjoyed it as much as I did. And... Hopefully, we figure out something to do to take care of Plank Tech once and for all. I've really got to warn everybody. But until next time, I am the real Mr. Gold, and I hope you have a better than average day. Goodbye, everybody. Wow. What a pretty view. <laughs>